What's going on YouTube? Geosna right here. In today's video we have a new update to the Dopamine Jailbreak, the Dopamine 2, which supports iOS 15.0 all the way up to iOS 16.6.1 on ARM64 devices and all the way up to iOS 16.5.1 and 16.5 on newer devices like iPhone 13, 12, 11, 14 and stuff like that. So a brand new update has dropped, it contains a lot of important things, it does patch a lot of bugs, we're gonna get into that in a second. This video is brought to you by Tenorshare Reboot, a software that allows you to repair your iOS iOS device if it's no longer booting, stuck in a boot loop, recovery mode, DFU mode, or it doesn't power on in general. You can also downgrade, upgrade to sign versions and also one click reset. Definitely check the program out in the link below. So the recently updated Dopamine Jailbreak has received a new version today is the version 2.0.6. Opa334, the main developer of the Dopamine Jailbreak, posted this. Dopamine 2.0.6 is out and a link to GitHub and this is the version release in here. An IPA file and a TIPA file are both of available and the 2.0.6 does a lot of things. Now the most important thing appears to be in here that more KFD adjustments have been made which should make the exploit much more reliable. They also fixed support for iOS 16.4 beta 1 and 16.4 beta 3 so everything in between should work now fine. They also had fixed a couple of uh, UI components and they added some UI improvements. Also worked around a stock bug and fixed a couple of uh, zombie processes getting created when user space is rebooting and also fixed around random panic caused by launch the crash when trusting certain files. So this should make the jailbreak much better, much more reliable, so definitely go ahead and update. You can find the information about dopamine jailbreak release here on this article containing also the supported versions. You can also see exactly how to install it and how to download it and um, the changelog and stuff like that. So definitely check this page out in the link below. But it's actually quite simple to update to the new version directly from the device. So if you have a device that is already jailbroken with dopamine you have the application installed you can just go here in dopamine and it says update available you can press in here and press update and it would go to github where you could find the latest ipa file so you'd scroll down in here and get the tipa file this assumes that you do have troll store installed because the recommended method to install dopamine is with troll store so go ahead get a tipa file wait for it to download press download in here it should take a few seconds to download and after that you tap in here go to download tap the dopamine and and then share it with the arrow up above and go to troll store this should open it in troll store press install and it will be updated and that's how you update dopamine directly on the device without a computer if you have troll store installed and dopamine application or even if you don't have the dopamine application simply by going on github and getting the tip file now you have the latest version in here you can see no update and you can fiddle with the settings and stuff like that so yeah, that's how you get the latest update definitely go ahead and get it it does contain a lot of important fixes except so yeah, thank you for watching i'm gsnow till the next time. Peace out.